Okay, hey guys, so today, in this video, let's talk about kind of a, a different way to think about growing your business. Now, one, one thing that I'm, I'm, and this is not something like, I'm never criticizing people when I say this, it's just kind of my observation of, of working with, you know, hundreds of people inside of our program. And, you know, we've spoken to about 20, I believe at this point, it's like 2,500 people have applied to join a mentorship program um, over like the last, um, since 2019. And the, the key thing is that the problems that a lot of people have today are caused by the necessities of things that happened in the past. So what I mean by that is oftentimes to have to have success, you really need to set yourself up for success in, in like as soon as possible because, give me one second. Because as we kind of go and get get in the game, it gets harder and harder to really set yourself apart and be able to actually have the life and the business that makes it you know easy to kind of retire early, be able to have more of that freedom, be able to travel. So the reason why I say that is because, you know, having the time to be able to start a business. When you have a family, a job, maybe you have a couple hobbies, it's very, 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 very hard to do. Now, it's not impossible by any means. You just have to learn how to use automation. Like inside of our mentorship program, we do help people that have like a family. We had a student who, um, she was a wife, she had five kids, and she worked accounting for like a school district. So it can be kind of hectic when you work for a school district. And she still got her business really, really successful, right? So it can be done. It's just you have, the, the less time you have, the more precise you need to be with your business. And you don't really have as much, as much leeway for mistakes. If you're, maybe, let, let's say that you're like watching this video and you're like a, a 20 year old that has like no family, no real commitments. Maybe you live in like an apartment, right? So you, all you have to really pay is like your rent, just like basic um, expenses. You have a lot, it's a lot easier for you to make mistakes in your life and still be able to go be successful, right? Because number one, you have all the free time in the world. Number two, you have more energy than what people who are a little bit older have. Um, and plus, like, it, you just have a, it's easier to kind of build a life well from the start because you don't need to quite make as much money in order to go succeed, right? But as we get kind of older, we have like less time, we have less energy. We, in a lot of cases, have less money because you have more expenses, right? Children are expensive. Children can't, not that like it's bad and like children are like based on money, but it is, it is expensive, right? So, the, but the unfortunate thing is, even if you're in that position, it only gets harder as you get older because you have less and less energy to be able to go and go after promotions, to be able to go and advance your career, and it gets harder. So while you have the opportunity to change, change your position, while you have the opportunity to start that business, if there's any amount of free time you have, any amount of excess energy, you need to utilize that to go and grow. Because there is a point in time where it becomes very, very hard to go and like, unless you're very precise and you know exactly what you're doing, you're not gonna be able to go and succeed in business. Now this is not meant to kind of like scare you or anything, it's just more of like, just letting you understand the reality. Cause sometimes I hear people and they say like, oh, well, I've been thinking about starting my business or I'm thinking about, or you know, like maybe, maybe I'll start. And it's like, it sounds really good. And like, I don't really have this kind of, this doesn't really happen for people who watch my YouTube channel, but I'm trying to really, just in case you're someone watching and you are kind of feeling like that, you know, life moves a lot faster than what you think it does. And the only, the only way that time is helpful when building wealth is if you already have assets and resources built up. So let's say for example, they talk about like the, the law of compound, right? You put a little bit in today and it keeps growing and growing and growing and growing and doubling and doubling and doubling. If you already have $500,000 in the bank, you, you want time to roll because it's rolling and it's doubling and it's getting bigger and bigger. But if you have $10 in the bank, it's like you don't have as much time to waste. So the less that you have and less that you kind of like have, like the less room for error that you do have, the, the earlier you need to start. And like, you know, the best time to start something was 20 years ago. The next best time is really today. It's to move forward when you have that opportunity. As soon as you feel that it's time to go, you can move. 
And keep in mind, like you don't have to just like fully launch into your business. It can be very sequential. Like you can go and get a couple clients, get an extra thousand a month, two thousand, three thousand a month. Build that safety fund, build build that excess savings so that when you get to like six, seven, eight grand a month, you can number one is consistent, but all the months you were at the three, the four, the five thousand a month, you've been putting that away almost like a security kind of fund for when you quit your job, just in case maybe you lose a client or two, you're not hurting for money because you have this excess money sitting there. It's almost like a we they call it a war chest inside of your business. It just gives you security, it protects you from if clients leave, and just really builds that confidence that you need to go and like grow your business. Cause that's that's what a lot of people struggle with. They just don't have the confidence for you know good reason. If you don't have stuff moving, if you don't have stuff like ready to go, it doesn't make sense why you would have a lot of confidence. And that's what I see when some people are like, you know, I'm kind of nervous to start my business. I can't afford for this thing to fail. It's like, well, you know, on the one hand, you can afford for it to fail, but what you can't afford is to not ever launch because your life is going to move by too fast and you're going to miss out on all the time that you could have been spending with your family if you had just gotten your gotten some stuff together made some slightly different choices and even though things in the situation was not perfect you still launched you still figured out a way to make it work hmm. I'm trying to get this lighting just to be perfect but you know i think one day we'll get it perfect who knows who knows okay so not in this video like not trying to like hurt you by its feelings not trying to say anything mean or anything like that i'm just like i really want to make sure we kind of light a fire under your butt that's like even though it's not ideal, even though like maybe maybe you feel like like maybe maybe you're on the older side of the spectrum, you're getting close to retirement age, and you feel like maybe life has kind of either passed you by or it's too late for yourself. It doesn't have to be. It can take anywhere from like six months to like a year to really get to six figures inside of an accounting or bookkeeping business. You just have to do things the right way. Like you can't go after a bunch of small clients at a hundred bucks a month. It's just going to take too many clients to do that. You're not going to be able to fulfill on the clients. You're not going to have the energy to go and deal with that many clients, and it's just it's just a mess, right? But, and here's another reason too, right? A lot of like small clients want to do like meetings. So they want to do either a weekly meeting or a bi-weekly meeting or even once a month. If you have like a hundred clients, that's a hundred of these meetings. Like imagine you do a hundred meetings a week. Even if it's like 30 minute meetings, that's still 50 hours worth of just meetings alone, right? Versus you had like one or two small clients at like $3,000, $5,000 a month. That's a lot less face-to-face -face interaction time. And you can really focus more on doing the work than being in meetings all day. You know, so it's just all about learning how to be precise. And if you understand how to go and build the marketing system so that leads are coming to you, it doesn't take quite as much time to actually go do the marketing every single day. In a lot of cases, you can go on vacation and still get clients. Like I get clients even when I'm on vacation, right? And it's not that I'm like special or, or any better than you if you're like watching this. It's just I've set up my life in the past. I set up my life uh, nine years ago so that it gets easier and easier and easier for me to make money every single day, every single month, every single year. Right, so I want to give that to you. That's why I always am so like encouraging people to join our mentorship program. It's not because I just want to make money from the mentorship program. I really want to help you out because this is the thing that changed the life for me. And it's no. Here's one thing most people don't understand. It's no fun living a life where you have complete freedom and no one else around you except for your family has complete freedom. Right, having friends is important in life. Having friends who are wealthy, having friends that are talking about meaningful stuff, having friends that think the way you do is very, very important. Right, so I'm building a group of friends by building this mentorship program. The students we've helped, I mean, it's just amazing. Right, anytime I go travel, I can go see the students. We talk, we have dinner. I meet their family, they meet my family. It's just really, really great to be able to kind of have that those conversations, and it's been very, very rewarding. Right, so it's. It's really about making sure I can help the next person out, right? Because that's that's one thing that 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 um, one of my mentors made me promise when I was um, starting out was like, because I had to pay him a lot of money to to learn how to like do this stuff. I was like basically shadowing him, and he was saying, you know, just kind of always try and put the ladder down behind you. Don't just like take the ladder up so no one else can climb up, right? Because it's like that's that's not really, um, in my opinion, what God kind of wants. I think God wants us to share with other people the goodness that like has kind of happened and like kind of give the secrets away right that's that's what i believe i don't know if that's you know if that's 100 percent right but that's at least where i am in my life right now where it's, we're trying to give back as much as possible because i mean i'm not going to be here forever like i'm not going to be on youtube forever i'm probably only going to do like this mentorship program for another maybe like three to seven years into the future right and like once once i stop you know offering the mentorship open to the public i'm just going to only talk to people that have been in there previously and we're just going to carry on with our life and we'll be good and we're just going to meet up every year just say hey, 
hopefully things are going good. How are things with you? And that'll be it. So while I'm still here, while I'm still, you know, giving, while I'm giving all this free videos and all these free advice, like take advantage of it while you can, right? So get help, book a call, do it. Let's, let's see if the mentorship program can help you out while we're still here. Okay. Um, and not to say like, um, Again, my, my intention is not to scare you with that, but it's just to kind of give you the reality. Like, it's, it's very easy, like, when you see my videos and you just see, it's like, well, he's just going to be here forever. It's kind of like the same thing with, like, I want to start my business one day. One day, someday is not a day of the week. It's not a time. It's not a day of the month. It's not a day of the year, right? So it's like, if you ever have, like, a little bit of space, if you have some savings and you feel like this is the direction that you want to go in, go in and make sure you have certainty by investing in a program that can actually take you to where you need to go. We have a very proven track record. Um, love to show you if you have any questions. Uh, we have a lot of different research material you can use. We can go and give you, I can shoot you up 40, 50 testimonials in five minutes, as well as a bunch of different behind the scenes coaching calls. So they have a lot of different like proof assets to make sure you feel really comfortable if this is a decision that you want to go after, okay? So if you want to learn a little bit more, you want to see if this is a good fit for you, go ahead and click the link inside the description, either above or below the video to book a call, see if we can help you inside of a mentorship program, okay? Um, I will talk to you soon. I will see you inside of the next video. Take it easy. Talk to you soon.